Welcome back everybody. In today's video, we'll be taking a look at the arrest of Press NH now as he was driving on the highway and he got pulled over because he was violating a restraining order by being in the same car as his nine months pregnant girlfriend. Now he says that the restraining order was no longer active, but he got arrested anyways. He also says that the charges got dropped, but that doesn't really matter because the part that's really funny is that a week later, he got arrested for call flooding because he was so angry about this incident. So even if this case doesn't go anywhere, he will definitely be found guilty of the call flooding case. Without further ado, enjoy the video. Before you for 20. 10 -3. Comes back to me and there is a criminal bail order between him and. Is her descriptors in there? Did you find her descriptors, please? Well, is this the white car? Yeah, affirmative. Yeah, he put me out. I'm going to be stopping at Hanker Street exit. Yeah, Nick, go ahead and start this way. He's pointing out the window and stuff. So is that not the office? We're Route 9 and Hanker Street. 10 5. How are we doing? How are you? Mo Vance with Hillsborough PD. What's your name, ma'am? You know better than that. What's that? You know better than that. Okay, cool. Do you you know better than that. Okay, do you have a driver's license? What are you, on what are you pulling me over I'm for? pulling you over for because you. Because I went like that to you? Nope. Oh, was this the other one? Nope. No? Okay. It wasn't because you out know I flipped you out. Go ahead, step for out what? of the car for me. Step out of the car for me. Ask okay? me what for you have a criminal bail order against a female with matching her description, I so do not. step out of the car. I do not. You do. Okay? I can give you my ID okay, and you can double check. Go ahead, step out of Is the car. Is that what you're I'm asking you to step out of the car. Do you, do you have ID? Yes, I do. Okay. All right. Am I being so detained we, right now? You yeah. are. For what time? Okay. For what time? So we can right now. Or for what time, sir? What's that? Don't, don't touch her. She's pregnant. Okay. Q. Q. Listen. Q. I'm not resisting, so don't put that. Are you body? You got body cam? Are you recording? I already, I already told What's you. What's your name and badge number? ID yourself. ID yourself. Do you have ID on you? What's your name? Because I, I told you, we're trying to ID him, okay? This is a car registered to somebody that has a protection order against somebody that matches your description. Okay, okay he has one. For who? For a, a, a woman matching your description. That's why I asked you what your name was. But, I mean... Do you have ID? If, I, if you're not the woman, guess what? We let him go and see you later. What's your name? If you have ID on you, then I'll... What did you pull us over for, honestly? For that. For that. Yeah, okay. That's not me. I, this I don't isn't have, you? That's me. He has I a criminal bail order what? out against you. He can't be around you. How? What's that? How? Just stay over there. I don't want you to get hit. I don't care if you film, but you're going to stay right here, okay? I don't how, want you to get how hit. Is that? Can I see this order? I can give you my ID okay, and you can double check. Go ahead, step out of Is the car. Is that what you're pulling me I'm asking you to step out of the car. It's on camera. It's, on camera. it's in my, uh, my wallet's in the thing. So there's something that's really unsettling me with this video. And no, it's not just the frauditor's face. It's the fact that when he got pulled over, you can clearly see that there is cigarette smoke that is coming out of his vehicle. And meanwhile, he's there with his nine months pregnant girlfriend the one that is carrying his unborn child. 
So he is willing to put his child's health at risk just because he wants to have a cigarette and he can't wait till they pull over. Mark Manchon, I know that you will be a terrible father because you're not able to put your child's interest ahead of your own. So that is a clear sign that you will be a piece of shit father. When you have a kid, it's time to put your priorities aside and put the priorities of your family first. And smoking in front of a nine months pregnant woman is absolutely despicable. But I would have expected nothing else from a frauditor. I didn't know it's in my car. I told you that. I'm telling you, I didn't know it. Don't run, guess. run the plate through your, your job, job, bro. Is that your your car? Well, I'm not gonna answer well, those questions. I did, did not say right. you did not. I did not right. say I'm not right. identified. I didn't do anything wrong. Where is the defendant's name? Look at my hey. This is her. So this is her. That's, That's him. Mark. Where is the he has order? a criminal bail order against. He's right. not allowed to be around. It was you. dropped. So Everything it's still was showing dropped. in the system. We have to figure that out. I'm just trying to ask questions Everything to figure it out. Was dropped, sir. Okay. Look, this I'm could pregnant. Been... Like, are you serious? Like, I'm literally like due okay. any day now. But you have to understand. If it shows up in the system and I come up and ask a question, all you guys had to do is ID yourselves and say, "Oh wait, no, that was dropped." Here, can you call in? Can you? Okay? Well, I then, mean, no. You guys want to play this game, record, do all this stuff, that's fine. If you want to play that game, that's fine. It's not a game. It's for our protection. We have cameras, am I too. Am I going to get my thing back? Covered. Are you requesting the order be faxed in? <laughs> yeah, from this. What is the situation on that order say on the screen? You're finding it's dropped, but, finding it's dropped, you, still but you still have it in front of you. Well, it comes up with a bright red tab with a lot of noise. And it says not expiring. It was served in January. It was dropped at the okay, last it's, court. It's still in the system. Okay, so that's all he had to do, or all you had to do was say, "Oh no, that was dropped." Could you could you double check on? I can give you my ID. Okay, and you go ahead. Check. Go ahead. Step out of is the car. Is that what you're I'm asking for? you to step out of the car. I mean, what are okay. what are you what is he being arrested on? Because if he's not allowed to be around you, we live together. Like we've lived literally like. Guess together what? if like... the criminal if, if the courts put a criminal bail order said he can't be around you that's how it goes okay do you understand that? i guess i okay I just so just hang out we're gonna get it faxed to us and see if it's still valid you have yes. fax machines yep all right can okay. i have my license back yep. Are you... just one second okay just confirm that you have on that protection list. You, you're gonna need my Why that? Because there's another state of New Hampshire, same everything, name, birthday, everything. Okay, all right, so he's the defendant, his date of birth, descriptions match up, you're the plaintiff in the criminal bail protective order, okay? I guess. So he's in direct violation of reach of bail. When I run the plate, it pops up, okay? Whether you said it got dropped or not, I don't know what to tell you, okay? It is what it is. We're going to get the hard copy faxed to us. If it was showed that it was amended, that's fine. You realize that all of this could have been avoided if you or him just said, hey, yeah, that was dropped. You have a criminal bail order against a female with matching her description. I so do step out of the car. I do not. You do. So let's run with this theory just for a second that the protective order has indeed been dropped. Isn't it strange that this woman is about to have a child with a man that she was so terrified of at some point that she went to the cops to have the authorities protect her from him and now she is willing to have his child? I mean, some people are just insane. Some women love their abusers for some reason. Obviously, there's something wrong with this guy and there's proof right there. At one point, she was so scared of him that she needed the law to intervene. Anyways, I see misery in her future because Mark Manchon is not a decent human being. The criminal bail order against, he's right. not allowed to be around It was you. dropped. It was dropped. It was dropped. Okay. 
<laughs> that, do you understand what I'm I going guess, with? All the yelling and screaming didn't help anybody. We're trying to figure it out. I was yelling and screaming. I was he, like, what I'm, the I'm, f is yeah, going on? I'm he, pregnant, dude. Right, like, but when I asked you, I said, ma'am, what's your name? And then he started with it. You know you don't have to answer that, blah, blah, blah. I mean, I legally don't. That's my you right. You legally do. No, okay, I'm, I'm the passenger. Okay, but I'm But I'm the passenger When I'm investigating a crime. Are you investigating me? I'm, I'm hanging out. He just told me to no, hang out. The moment, so. Okay. so where is your... Where is your... So he didn't identify himself as a driver of the vehicle, so at the very least he's under arrest for disobeying an officer. So you're all set. You can leave. If where, you don't leave, I'm going to tell your car. Where do I go? To we're going to take, take him to PD. But if the order comes back saying that you're not allowed to be together, you can't pick them up. Can I hang out at least until you get sure, the order back? Sure, you can go to the PD. Yeah, That's fine. we're going to the PD now. Yeah, we're going to go to the PD. Can I follow so. you then? Yeah, I have no idea go. where I am. Yeah. You're going to take the next exit and then go down. I'm just going to follow you because okay. I have no idea okay. where I am. Now, I just want to point it out there. I'm not saying this is 100% a fact. It's just a theory of mine. But she is slurring her speech. She sounds like she's half awake. She says she has no clue where she is. So I really hope that she's not drinking or doing narcotics while she's pregnant because that would be terrible. Then again, her judgment is not too good because she is having a baby with an egotistical maniac that gets arrested on a monthly basis. But I'm just pointing it out there. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. 339. Hey, so... Can you, uh... I have a radio with that, that criminal bail order is no, I'm valid. We're going to have a 17. If you can get Brenda started, so we can speed this up. Get a bail for my if you can. Please call that out. We already, we already did for you, okay? I didn't do anything wrong. For you. I didn't do anything wrong. That bail condition order is invalid. It's invalid. Andrew, back to the PD. What's up? You still recording? I am. Yep. What am I under arrest for? Disobeying. I'm just getting off the that's, Baker Street exit. Um, I what? said I do not consent to any search and seizure. Yeah, I can't okay. I heard you. Kevin. Never said I wasn't going to identify myself, but all of us in my vehicle. Okay. Apparently, you already knew who I was since you got a bail condition order, right? There you go. Put that on record. You already knew who I was because you pulled me over on the probable cause of it. Uh, now I'm under arrest, right? For it? That's, that's funny. D disobeying an officer is invalid. Okay. Along with the bail condition order. Okay. Disobeying an officer is invalid? Says who? Says the YouTube lawyer that gets arrested almost every month? That got arrested in Georgia even though he was just there on vacation? This guy is something else, man. At this point, you would think he would realize that he doesn't know shit since he's always getting himself arrested. But then again, he needs his clicks and views, so he's going to pretend like he knows what he's talking about. Did you get my phone? Did you get my phone? I have your phone and your wallet. And she gave me a debit card for you. For bail, because you don't have enough cash on you. Bail condition uh, state that it's out of um, I haven't, County. I haven't looked at it yet. I haven't looked at it yet. There was one when I tried back in January, right? Yeah, but it's been annulled, man. Okay. Ever since. Understand, it's still showing in the system. Okay. So, you know how many interactions I've had with police officers with her in, in play in actually walking before I went to the court hearings okay. with her? There's All right. never in Sullivan County and there's never been an issue. Okay. All right. If if this you had just answered yeah, those now, questions, but now, but now you're stretching this into a uh, no nope. something like like I was well, not, I was already not, under arrest for a bail condition violation. I'm not. No, nope. I told you were you were being detained at one point. Okay. Good. Yeah. Okay. When we put you into handcuffs, you were when we were. You have my plate number. You ID me because of probable cause you had supposedly, right? I sorry. The radio's talking. What you say? I probable cause. The obstruction. I probable cause to pull you over. Okay. You are required to ID yourself yeah, yeah. as the operator of a motor vehicle. Yeah, of course. I, I, I totally understand. I okay. No and you that. wouldn't tell me your name. You refused. No. That's not Okay. True. All right. I didn't give you my ID okay, and you could ahead. double check. Go ahead. Step out of Is the car. Is that what though. you're pulling me I'm asking you to step out of the car. 
That's not true. I, okay. I, I just said I didn't consent to any search or seizures, that's all. Okay. My wallet was not on my person. You asked me for my ID, it's in my car. Okay. Never disputed that I wouldn't give you my ID. I asked you what I was being detained for. Yeah, I, I tried to explain it to you, but you kept talking. You wouldn't listen. Okay, but you wouldn't you wouldn't listen. If you had just said, no, hey, man, that was dropped. Can you check on that, please? He has a criminal bail order against... He's right. not allowed to be around It was dropped. It was dropped. It was dropped. I was trying to get dispatch to call... To get out of the vehicle. Right, I correct. Because on. you because I you complied. immediately start... No, you yeah, did you not. open the door and you complied. So, and I complied. Even right. You, you, I should have to ask you one time. That's it. Well, come on, man. I don't know what to tell you. Oh, so you know what? You made it. You made the trouble for yourself. Okay. All right. So. Yeah. Let me see you on YouTube, buddy. I'll well, slow down. That's the driveway. Make sure she turns. Can't believe this one. Yeah, are you, you going to still get into the bottom, literally to the bottom of the bail condition? Because of Correct. Yes. I am. Literally, you need to call the prosecutor or the state police. I, I, I have the... the state police. I, I, yeah. Are you just... Just let me talk, okay? I'm I'm going. I have the bail order coming to the PD, okay? I on the side of the road. I tried getting. Listen, listen to me, okay, Mark. I tried getting dispatch to read the order and get a copy of it. Can you? I have a radio that criminal bail order is valid in the computer. From what I can see, it is active. Hold hold on. When I walk up to the when I walk up to the car and you're immediately hey. You, I'm gonna do all this. Guess what? That's guess what? If you guess what? Him. What's that? I did that to him driving by. Okay, cool. That's why I'm getting okay. pulled over. That that's not why you're getting pulled over. You're getting pulled over because of the the bail order on your license yeah, plate when I ran it. What's that? I don't. I didn't know who you were, but I had probable cause. Yeah, I agree. Right. So it has nothing to do with a middle finger or anything like that. I bet you he didn't even see that. So I'm still uh, hot over here. <laughs> State police, man. Okay. Prosecutor, uh, we're going to bail that on court We don't want you here longer than you want to be here. This is Officer Patton back here. Officer Patton, because you're not as mad at him, is going to do your booking with bail. He's going to get you out of here, okay? <laughs> So there you have it, another one bites the dust, another idiot arrested. Now what's really interesting about this case is that it is possible, and I do possibly believe him, that the charges were dropped for this case. But this started a chain of event where he ended up call flooding the station, and those charges have certainly not been dropped. So dude, you played yourself, you're a moron, all for clicks and views. It's definitely not worth it, but at least we're here to laugh. And I don't think you're going to get away with your call flooding trial this time. Anyways, thanks for watching, everybody. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and turn on all notifications. And I'll see you guys on the next one. I live here.